Hi, this is Sahana. In this video, we are going to learn how to extract a substring from a given string. In C Sharp, we can use the substring method to extract a substring from a given string. Let's write simple program and understand this concept. First, I will ask the user to enter a string. This will print the message on the console window saying enter a string. And we are using ReLine method to read a input from a console window. And we are storing this in a variable and this is a string type variable. Next, we are going to get start index and length of a substring. Next, we are going to extract the substring using substring method. We are going to use substring method from a string class. The substring method has different overloads. We are going to use substring method which takes start index and length of a substring. Let's see how to do that. And here we have written if else condition. Here we are checking for few conditions. Look at this statement. Here we are using substring method to extract a substring and we are passing this start index and length of a substring. This substring method has different overloads. Before extracting a substring, we are checking whether the start index is greater than zero because the string index always starts from zero and we are checking start index is less than the length of an input string and we are also checking if substring, if substring length is greater than or equals to zero. If true, we are extracting substring and we are printing it on the console window else we are printing error message. Let's test it now. Okay, I will enter a string and say C sharp is a programming language. Now enter the starting index. I will enter zero then enter the length of the substring. I want to extract 10. Hit enter. This is an extracted substring. If you want to analyze the output, here is a table with index of each of the character in a string. Here is a full program. You can write this program and test for different inputs. You can also use the substring method with only the starting index as an argument. This will extract the substring starting from the specified index until the end of the original string. That's it for today's session. Thanks for your time. See you soon in the next video. Thank you.